Hello guys, welcome back to Nitos footage. I hope you all are doing good. In this video, we are gonna discuss about important chemistry, important chapters, including important topics of respecting chapters. And if you are before starting this video, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe, like, and comment if you have any doubts and share this video to your friends. Your each share may set up a new life for your friends and let's start the video first starting with stoichiometry of class 11 it's indirectly they will be asking of 7% weightage it has but directly 4% weightage in stoichiometry lesson we have most important uh, most important topics like concentration terms mole analysis equation based questions Redox balancing oxidation states and oxidizing and reducing agent identification. Structures of Br3O8, C3O2, H2S4O6. These topics are most important for the upcoming NEET exams. And this is taken based on NTA based 2019 and 2020 analysis. Over the proof, see this table. This is uh, in 2020, they had a asked a question from significant figures. Law of chemical combination and mold concept in the subtopic of mold concept. In even same, it has asked the same in the 2019 also. This is up to the stoichiometry lesson. Then, then let's go for atomic structure. Atomic structure holds 4% of weightage. In its most important topics are quantum mechanical model, Heisenberg's uncertainty principle, and de Broglie, de Broglie principle. In atomic structure, you should we should must all the insert solve examples of class 11 textbook of this respective chapter and this chapter for the proof if we have seen the previous year questions it from Bose model of hydrogen subtop absorption or repulsion subtop in 2019 in 2019 they have asked a question that's so easy one and in 2019 all in same 2019, they ask another question quantum mechanical model of atom in orbital energy based. They ask another question that's average question. This is atomic structure. Then let's go for periodic table. Periodic table holds 2% of weightage. In this, most important subtopics are periodic trends and expected exceptions in modern periodic table. And we should uh, revise, we should revise and remember terms like radius ionization energy and the energy of affinity energy of negativity and along with this acidic basic oxide strengths and covalence is most important for this proof we have we are going to see here two in modern period table in subtopics modern period table from period table in 2020 they have given two questions that are so easy and from ionization and enthalpy trend in 2019, they have asked a question that's average. And next, coming to chemical bonding. Chemical bonding holds 7% of weight age. In these most important subtopics are molecular orbital theory, writing such as, such as hybridization, shape, lone pair bond pairs, isoelectronics, bond orders. Along this, bond lengths, bond angle, bond angle comparisons like NH3. NF3 like its examples. This is so important in chemical bonding, so easy to remember and so easy to score marks. For this proof, if you see here in dipole moment and bond polarity from dipole moment in 2020, they has they have asked a question that's average in toughness, average in difficulty. If you see valence bond and molecular orbital theory from mark MOT, they have asked a question in 2020. That's average in difficulty. And if you come to 2019, same from MOT, they have asked a question. Again, from valency bond theory, they have asked another question. Both are same average in difficulty. This is up to chemical. Now let's come to states of matter. States of matter holds 2% of the weightage. It main subtopics are DLDS, Dalton's law. You all may be familiar with this. If we come to the proof, gas law. Gas law and ideal gas ideal gas equation if you see here Griffin's law of diffusion Dalton's law of partial pressure 2020 it holds one mark one question 
that's average in difficulty in 2019 from van der Waals equation you have um, there is a question that's average in difficulty now let's come to another chart that's thermodynamics 4% it holds weightage you may be familiar with this equation dh equals to du plus dl rt in this is the most important equation many numericals will be asked in final exam if you come here the next subtopic important subtopic is work done isothermal work done isobaric work done free expansion this is the most important thing they may ask work done in the free expansion like this some numericals will be asked in final exams next coming to entropy theory solved example in ncrt this is most important you should uh, check it ncrt for the solved examples and if you come to this next equation is dg equals to dh minus t delta s t ds this is also one most one of the most familiar equation you should remember this equation for exam and next important subtopic is thermochemistry in thermochemistry compulsory you should solve free air questions Previous year questions gives a a new platform for you for the preparation. The next coming to for the proof, first law and basic fundamentals of the thermodynamics. First law of the thermodynamics in 2020 they have given a question that's average in difficulty. In 2019 they have given another question that's average in difficulty. Then coming to entropy and second law of thermodynamics. From second law of thermodynamics they have question they have given a question in 2020 that's average in weight in difficulty then coming to entropy they have given in 2020 20, uh, 2019 they have given a question that's easy in difficulty then next coming to equilibrium chapter equilibrium holds two percent to four percent this is an uh, related term because it contains both chemical equilibrium and ionic equilibrium some sometimes they may be asking more questions from ionic equilibrium or sometimes they may be asking from chemical equilibrium Coming uh, by intermixing both, the most important topics are subtopics are uh, DGK relation based problems, KPKC calculations, and relation between these two terms. And next, properties of K means effect of temperature. Um, they will give uh, K based numericals, means they will give one of one K value for one equation and they will say to find K value of another equation. Like this, um, numericals will be asking from this topic. Let's coming to pH calculations and CRT solved examples. For uh, you must solve this, otherwise it will be a difficult task for you to uh, solve numericals like this. And next coming to solvability, NCRT solved examples. Same like pH calculations. You should refer NCRT textbook for uh, solved examples. Next coming to buffer theory and formula. You should remember the buffers formula and uh, remember the buffer theory which you should add, which you should, which will nullify. Such concepts you should remember for uh, getting good marks in equilibrium topic. Now coming to proof. If you see here, in 2020, they have asked a question that's average in difficulty, relation between K and G. And coming to 2020, from solvability, they have asked another question that's difficult. Yeah, this is the first we have seen a difficult. Then coming to 2019. From Bronsted acids and bases, you see a question that's easy in difficulty. Then coming to pH scale, there is another question in 2019 that's easy. Again in 2019, you see a solubility product, another question that's average. This is up to equilibrium, both ionic and chemical. Now let's go for hydrogen and its compounds. This topic is so easy and it holds 2% of weightage. In this, you should Compulsory of uh, one or two times you should give a superficial chapter reading means peripheral or superficial means you should uh, read it uh, like simply then Im then important topics in this are hardness of water theory of hardness of water is most important in hydrogen and its compounds you should read it compulsory then coming to next H2 hydrogen peroxide is theory and NCRT solved examples are must for this channel for this chapter if you do not solve any ncrt solved examples for this lesson you may feel difficulty in the final exam if you observe the trend in 2019 they have asked a question from hardness of water that's average in difficulty this is the proof and next coming to s and s and p blocks in this we have included both s and p blocks 
it's eight percent it holds eight percent of weightage that's highest i think till now snp blocks is completely we consider it as inorganic you should read ncrt minimum five to six times you should remember each and every point you should remember exceptions everything you should remember from snp blocks in final exam the questions of this inorganic will be like if you it will be like do or die if you know answer you will suffer if not you will leave the question in the exam pressure if you get the, the confusion between two options due to negative negative mark pressure you will leave the question and you will unattempt it that's the main reason read in CRT minimum five to six times next important topic is structures existence of compounds ionic compounds and you should see here which are ionic compounds which are the covalent compounds exceptions will be some uh, some examples will be exceptions you should remember that then coming to direct lines of statement type questions referring this is most important this i hope i said direct lines will be given from ncrt if you know them only they can uh, if you know them only you can answer it otherwise you should yeah. here we see s block for both the first group and second group and this is for uh, three block may third group and fourth group coming to here in 2020 they have asked two questions from alkali metals means first group one question from biological importance of alkali metals another question from properties of sodium chloride see here biological importance of alkali metals it will be given in ncrt if you do not read it then you cannot attempt this question here properties of uh, sodium chloride we if we try we may answer but this is most this is do or die like question and if you can next coming to alkaline at metals in 2019 they asked a question from properties of alkaline at metals compounds that's average in difficulty another question from biological importance of alkaline at metals that's one question easy see if you compare here they are they have given one biological importance of alkaline metals one question in 2020 another question in 2019 so by this you should many people leave this biological importance area they may say, they may think that this is not chemistry but if you see here biological importance is so important and next coming to third group that's boron family in 2020 they asked a question from multi structure uh, form that's average in difficulty another question from oxides of carbon in same 2020 another question multi concept that's zeolites allotropes oxides of carbon they have asked another question in 2020 if you come to 2019 Two questions were asked from properties of halides of group 14. This is direct two questions from the same topics. This is first time we have, I think we in this video we are seeing this two. That's average in difficulty. Next coming to organic chemistry. It holds eight to nine percent of nine percent of weightage. Organic chemistry in first year we have less, means we have all mechanisms, simple effects stability orders like that organic chemistry in second year is nice in first year also nice and um, first year's organic chemistry is the basis for second year organic chemistry in the or first year organic chemistry the most subtopics are mechanisms effects stability acidity and basicity, basicity, basicity. these terms should be clear and acidity basicity, uh, basicity stability and effects you should remember the you should remember the pathways and you should remember uh, you should be in a stage to compare the orders between them and next coming to techniques at the last we have filtration methods paper comedy like such techniques should be read in the final um, one or two questions may be coming from this and next coming to isomerism most important at least one or two questions will be coming from isomerism and next physical properties of compounds will be given at the start of uh, starting of each chapter you should remember them all if you come to the weightage of this means proof if here you see concept of reaction mechanism in organic compounds stability of carbocation or carbohydrate in 2020 they have given a question again they have given another question in chromatography or distillation they have given one if you come to 2019 electro Flick substitution reaction they have given a question that's average in difficulty next coming to hydrocarbons hydrocarbons holds two percent of the weightage 
hydrocarbons nothing you should do they are different completely you should read NCRT minimum five to six times you should remember every point and everything to come to proof from alkanes they have not given any question in 2020 or 2019 this means that they won't give in 2020 in any further in these previous two years they have not given they may give in the future if you come to alkenes they have given a question from in 2020 and another question in 2019. This is the most important. If you come to alkyne in the top subtopic reduction of alkyne, they have given another question. In, uh, they have given a question that's easy in 2019. Next, coming to environmental chemistry. Environmental chemistry holds two percent of the weightage. In environmental, environmental chemistry, also same thing. We should read NCRT for five to six times. Remember each and every point. Make a short notes. Um, make a short notes. You see here in from the topic air pollution in the subtopic of greenhouse effect. They have given a question that's easy question in 2019, and this is the final topic in the first year class 11. In the next video, I'm gonna make class 12 important topics and the trend of questions asking and friends up to that bye please like comment and subscribe if you have any doubts regarding need preparation comment uh, comment on the video sure i will reply you and if you have any further queries i will give my contact number you can contact me up to that bye bye